I build gaming computers with Lego bricks. In this video, I'm excited to show you some Lego Minecraft builds that came from parts of four different in-game maps by four different subscribers. I will also tell you why I built this tower and reveal a summary of requests a lot of you asked for, but try not to jump around too much because I hit a golden brick somewhere in this video. First person to answer correctly where it is will get a shout out in future content. Shout out to Frad's Lives for finding the golden brick in the previous two videos. So about a month ago, I told my YouTube and Discord community I would build a 16 by 16 chunk of anyone's in-game Minecraft build. What I got was this beautiful chunk by Omega Dan Kong. A nice build from Angle This that gives off, in my opinion, a cozy vibe. Then TJL Brick submitted this masterpiece of a chunk with a treehouse, mine shaft, cave, and a lot of elevated terrain. Last but certainly not least is this croissant stand from Devin Shorts. Starting off with TJL Bricks, this build was very challenging as I never seem to have all the Lego bricks I need. It isn't perfect, but for what it's worth, I'm personally impressed with how well it turned out. My favorite parts are the mineshaft and treehouse. I was running low on a lot of 2x2 two two tiles, so that's why there's a lot of jumpers on this chunk. Thank you so much for your submission. This was awesome. Moving over to angle this is the river and bridge. As this was a fairly simple build, I really love how much color and vibrance added to the area. The only issue I had were the street lamps. I just couldn't build them accurate enough, so we agreed I would build torches instead. Another solid submission. Thanks, bud. Now for Omega Dan Kong. He submitted this simple yet challenging build where the Omega Greek letter is carved out with water. It took a minute to space everything out correctly, then I got to building the cherry blossoms. But then I ran out of pink studs pretty quick, so there's not as many as there should be. Also, the stage in the middle has a statue that I couldn't accurately build. So we talked about it and I suggested a green creeper. He agreed and here we have it. Thank you for your submission, this was really cool. Lastly, Devin Short submitted the croissant stand. This was a lot of fun to build and I love the concept. And here's a croissant to go with it. And just look at the rest of this 16 by 16 chunk. All right, Devin Shorts, thank you so much for submitting this. These four were a lot of fun to build, especially for some very active subscribers that have been a part of my other requests. Speaking of other requests, let's talk about the tower. So this all started when Jash541 on Instagram asked for a purple block and an orange block. This created a huge wave of more requests. Angle This asked for a green block, MM asked for a blue on red block, CRB black one by one, Crazy Dean asked for a torch, gray one by one for Blobby, 2x2 two two Scion block for Gecko VR, a 2x4 orange piece for Njoku, head of a mob for TJL Bricks, purple for Moxie Watts, pink stud for Strawberry Ketchup, purple stud for Generic User, chicken for Mr. Maniac, blue one by one for Shark Attack, transparent brick for Fish, orange for Tia, yellow for Banana, red brick for Hydro Punk, black corner brick for Rylan, and finally a gray block for GT Lucky. If you want anything else, feel free to comment with your request and I'll do my best. Since the last video, I've been real busy with requests a lot of you asked for. So let's jump straight into that. So let's start off with the ghast as requested by Hello I'm Lego and Curse Lego Man. This was a basic build using just three different colored bricks, some tiles, and a little bit of time. I basically just built a cube with nine tentacles. Shout out to Omega Dan Kong in my Discord server who has to make it screaming and to Firebeast who asked to put a frog on top of the gas. Next up, I started building an M portal when Helicopter asked to put it around the CPU water block. This turned out really cool with the RGB lights behind it. And don't worry, no Lego bricks melted. Speaking of portals, check out this ruined nether portal I built as requested by the Mint and Exadiffy who asked for it months ago. I really enjoyed this build, which was also a pretty basic mock where I made the nether expanding out of the back just like JC Stamper asked for, although it's not an active portal. The most popular request was this command block. It was a little challenging to get the pattern as close as possible, and it isn't perfect, but I'm happy with it. And this is based off the old design as seen back in 2015, like with version 1.8.9. I couldn't build an asymmetrical design, at least with the pieces I have at the moment. Next is the sniffer, requested by Floor, Dwight Farrell, and Parker Boys. This was a lot of fun to build, and thank you all for your patience. Here's another old request, the axolotl that many of you asked for. I had to do a wild axolotl because brown bricks were plentiful at the time. The wither comes next as requested by many of you. Omega Dan Kong asked for Steve to be holding one of his heads, so I made that happen as well. I built this mushroom tree for Philip, 
And then a couple of you asked for a turtle. So I built this mock inspired by the small figure in the new turtle beach house set. I think mine looks better, honestly. Just saying. Strawberry Ketchup asked for a skeleton battle, which was a lot of fun, and then I built a bee. I couldn't find who requested this, but thank you if you're watching. Jace Janiac asked for a zombie horse, but I couldn't exactly build it accurately, so I put a zombie on a horse body. Basically, I built a zombie centaur. Shadow Gaming asked for a slime jumping into the portal. This was a lot of fun. I made a fox flying for GT Lucky, and now Steve is playing a mini PC for Zoid VR. Then Mydra Punk asked for Steve jumping into the portal. After that, Halo Cooper asked for Steve and Alex by the campfire. Speaking of the campfire, Bootsy's asked for a bunch of mobs around it. Super Ethan asked for Steve on a toilet. Zombiecraft asked for a zombie with no legs. Then I decided to make a Minecraft Skibidi toilet. I built the wolf a bunch of you had asked for, and also a highly requested Ender Dragon. These builds were a lot of fun to build. Thank you all for submitting requests and I'm sorry for those that I missed. Now, here's what I can't build, at least for now. A warden. A lot of you have asked for this and I would have to get one from the deep dark battle set because I simply don't have the correct pieces to make a decent looking mock. And Technoblade. As cool as it would be to make one in honor of, I simply don't have the correct bricks to make it accurate, nor do I have a crown. And that's about it so far. Coming up next, we're going to switch away from Minecraft for a little bit and move over to a LEGO City build. I'm real excited about this as I'm going to continue asking for requests. We're going to build a community LEGO art sculpture for one. It's going to be kind of like the bricks and the blocks that we built on this tower, but on the city setup instead. I'm also going to include mini stories like what some of the minifigures are up to on the LEGO City itself. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Stay tuned for that. I appreciate y'all watching this video. Now go find the golden brick and I'll see you in the next one.